Looks like it's showing right at 12 degrees. Let's go take a look at the sump pump, see if we're starting to freeze. Not as much as I thought. Looks like maybe two inches. The house is protected somewhat. Okay, let's zoom down in there and we'll shoot it with a temp gun. See what we get. 46 degrees on the side of the sump well. 44 right on the motor. But that's encouraging because it did get down to about 10 degrees on the low last night. There's the discharge itself, but we're still well above the check valve. Check valve is on the bottom, coming right out of the sump pump itself. That elbow is right at 40 degrees. So no worries there. Sometimes I get some funny readings on temp guns. They're not really consistent. So let's go with just an old-fashioned thermometer. Put it right down in the water. Let's take a look at the dip. There's on the top of the motor. Ground level is that red mark here. 32 inches to the top of the motor. Let's go down to the sump level. Looks like about 44 inches to the bottom of the sump to the ground level. Okay, let's check the mercury. That's dropping quick. Look at that. You can just watch it drop. When I pulled it up, it was right on 40. It was in the water. Okay, we'll pull the mercury up. It'll start to drop just as soon as it hits the air up here. Looks like 38 to 40. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask them in the comment section. And I uh, thank you for watching, and have a good one.